Welcome back to Noisegate. Today we are talking about some really big amps. Okay, not so big. But we are here today in the Noisegate Tone Lab and we are looking at battery powered amps. Now the old adage goes, it's not the size, it's how you use it. There is a global shortage of tubes, did you know that? So battery powered amps is where it's at. So we're gonna check out three very popular battery powered amps in three different price points. Starting over here, we've got the Marshall MS2, which is a one watt Marshall. It has a belt clip on it, so you can walk around and play Wonderwall wherever you are. For the slightly more serious battery powered amp connoisseur, we have got the uh, Blackstar Fly, which with two channels and delay built in, uh, it's also got a headphone output and an auxiliary input. And finally, for the tech nerds, we've got the iRig Micro Amp. 15 watts, connectivity with iOS and Android devices, three channels, auxiliary input, headphone output as well. Now, over the last three weeks, we've had a crack team of audio engineers in here acoustically treating this room. We have spared no expense to make sure that you guys are hearing exactly what we are hearing. The irony is not lost on us that we are miking up battery powered amps with a very, very high end microphone, but we wanted you to hear exactly what we're hearing. Let's check it out. In summary, the Marshall is the cheapest of the lot, but you can put it on your belt and you can annoy people with your Oasis impersonations. You can put it on your desk at work and remind people that you used to be a guitarist. In the middle, we've got the Black Star, three watts, two channels, delay built in, sounds great. Very tight sound, feels like a guitar amp. The iRig is the biggest, the most flexible and probably has all the connectivity, but that does come at a price. So that's about three times the price of the Black Star. I think I like the Black Star the best, especially for the purposes that you would use this amp, sitting on your desk in a rehearsal room, trying to play quietly. If you need a little bit more power from it, I like the fact that the Black Star for less than $100, you can add an extension speaker, and that's still cheaper than the iRig. So there you have it. We'd like to thank our crack team of acoustic and audio engineers for their miking precision. We'd like to also thank AKG for the C414 microphone so that you guys can hear exactly what these sound like. For more information on any of these amps, check out the links below and we'll see you next time at Noisegate.